Right you guys, got another video here for you. In this one we're going to take a look at how we can add more programs into our Party of Magic ISO. Now Party of Magic is a great tool uh, for technicians and as you can see it's packed with useful programs. Now what happens if you want to add more programs here, okay? Now as you can see it's got a lot of good programs, Disk Health, Clonezilla and stuff like that some good programs but if you want to add more programs like uh, say a Windows um, password resetting tool a CMOS resetting tool and stuff like that well you can do that with this uh, uh, program you can add more stuff in now say for instance you want TeamViewer or FileZilla or stuff like that well you can also add those in as well Wine, uh, Dropbox all those sorts of tools okay Chrome the list goes on and on so I'm going to show you how you can do that into your build. So you can see here we've got our Party Magic tool. I'm going to go back to the desktop and I'll show you how we can do that. Okay, so we're back at our desktop and uh, we're going to be using Party Magic here. Now Party Magic is a tool that I use for manipulating ISO images and stuff like that and building them. You can use whatever tool you like. There's loads of different ones out there, Universal ISO and loads of other different tools. You've seen me use quite a few over the years. Uh, this is a tool I'm going to be using, okay? So uh, we have on our desktop here our Party Magic ISO and also I've got a folder here with some files in here, the TXZ files. Now these files, you can get them off the internet or you can create your own, um, but they are all over the internet. You'll be able to drop, uh, get hold of these. Uh, you can see I've got Dropbox, uh, FileZilla, uh, PC CMOS Cleaner, uh, PC Disk Eraser, uh, PC Login Now and also RegEdit and and uh, team viewer. I'm going to add some of these in just to show you how easy it is. So let's open up our uh, Magic ISO program. All you're going to do here is open up our ISO image. We're going to find our ISO, and there it is on the desktop. And once we've got that open, you can see this is the actual disk here. These are the the actual directories on the side here. So we're going to go into P Magic, open that up, and inside there you'll see P modules. Once you go into P modules, you'll see a little folder called scripts and there'll be a file here. So we're going to add some files into here. Now on the bottom part of this program, if you're using uh, Magic ISO, uh, we're going to go into our Parted Magic folder where I've already got these files ready. Okay. So what I'm going to do is just drop these into this area. So I'm going to highlight this and just drop them into there. Okay. And then all I need to do here is just save and you can see it says bootable so it's still bootable okay so let me just reboot this back up into uh, my machine and we'll see what it looks like okay now we are at the desktop of Parted Magic and again as you can see here you can't see nothing just yet until I click on the area where it says system tools and you'll see that it's now dropped in a few programs that we've added in ie PC Reg Edit, PC Login Now and also PC Disk Eraser and PC CMOS cleaner all these tools have been added in and also now we can go into the internet side of things and we've got now FileZilla, Dropbox and also TeamViewer so these have also been added in also okay and all these are basically uh, tools that we can add in that are useful as a PC technician now if you're going to be uh, replacing uh, the actual Windows you can do that now I'm booting into a Linux based machine here but you can see that's what you would need to do and also, if you wanted to go into, say, for instance, uh, PC RegEdit or or any of these types of uh, tools, PC Disk Eraser, this will open this up, okay? And that's basically it in a nutshell, really. It's pretty straightforward to do. Um, you can wipe your drive securely if you've got any old drives that you want to sell on in an old computer, maybe, and you want to clean them off. That's how you can do it, using Party Magic. So I hope this has been helpful to you. My name is Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. If you enjoy these videos, guys, then hit the like button. It really does help me out. And also hit the subscribe button. If you want to keep up to date when I upload new videos, it will notify you. And then you'll know when I've uploaded a new video. So thanks again for watching, guys. And thanks for sticking around. Bye for now.